So now we're gonna talk about making seawater. Every week we're gonna change one gallon of water from the aquarium by removing one gallon and adding one gallon of seawater back. You can get seawater in a variety of ways. You can get it online, you can get it at your local fish store, or you can get it from us. Today we're gonna to be mixing some sea salt from us into this jug. We've got one third cup of salt. This is a one gallon jug, so we're going to carefully add it. And this has been calculated to make the proper salinity for one gallon. We have one gallon of fresh water, preferably filtered, reverse osmosis. Or bottled at your local store. So we're gonna add the fresh water to the salt. We're gonna fill it up about halfway. This way we can then begin to kind of mix it with our hands. Again, we wanna make sure our hands are clean, didn't have any uh, lotions or chemicals on them. So we'll just slowly kind of mix this salt in here and it dissolves very quickly. This salt, you're able to use this new water within about 20 minutes, the water goes clear. So once we've stirred it around and we don't feel any more salt in the bottom, we're gonna continue to add a little more water and top this off. Okay, we're now ready to add the rest of the fresh water. So we bring this to the proper salinity or specific gravity. And soon this will be ready to be added to your aquarium. All right, so we have our seawater ready to do our water change and we're gonna remove one gallon from the aquarium. So we'll lower the pitcher into the tank, just being careful not to knock any corals or rock over. Just slowly lower it down. And we'll lift the pitcher out. So we'll get rid of this water and we're gonna add the new seawater back to the aquarium. So we're adding our new seawater to the tank. We wanna be careful not to uh, pour it too quickly. And it's a good idea to pour it on the rock. That, that way it keeps it from stirring the sand everywhere and clouding the tank. You don't wanna pour it too quickly, just a nice steady pour. And we've now performed our weekly one gallon water change.